about fashion in terms of the circular economy really means that everything is taken into account right the way through from how the raw material is produced to the manufacturing process to energy, uh, water use, transport, packaging, all the way across. It all has to be transparent. Transparency is key. For all of these great designs and, and innovations from people like Griffin to have any great value, the consumer has to be part of that process, has to engage in why they're choosing that garment, how they're going to care for that, how they're going to launder it, reuse it, repair it, how they're going to make it part of their lives for a long period of time, not just for one season. It's creating garments that are not fast fashion, but creating fashion that is there and is a luxury. Griffin are using garments made out of second life fabrics. So what this means is, is taking fabric from the factory that are excess from a previous collection or something like that and making them into a new garment. It's a different way of thinking about sustainability and a different way of thinking about the longevity of a garment and about the treatment of waste as something that can be very precious and should be very precious and they will keep it in their collection for longer, they will keep it in their wardrobe, reuse it over a long period of time. One of the areas that the fashion industry is having most impact on is water. The impact of uh, plastics on oceans and, and waterways and those are now being used to develop new fibres, new innovation uh, that we're seeing coming through to our clothes that don't just do good for the environment, they're actually really comfortable and they've got a beautiful aesthetic quality to them as well. Sustainability is a core part of what the design is about, from the sourcing of the fibre through to the manufacturing of the cloth to the making of the garment and having the, the impact on water that the dye process has. They're actually using a zero water paper transfer printing process and that is much better than for the environment, saving something like 80% on water by using that process rather than the dye. The luxury fashion, the garment that you will keep in your wardrobe, use, reuse in different ways over years, that's sustainable fashion, that's luxury as sustainable fashion and that's where we need to be.